The grand meeting of the, to celebrate the 45th anniversary of the establishment of the National Assembly was held on Monday morning, October 26, in Vientiane capital. To honor the successes of the National Assembly in each period of time, the party and government has awarded the National Assembly one National Gold Order and a Class 1 Isla Order to Madame Pani Yatotu for her contribution as President of the National Assembly, which is the representative of the rights, powers and interests of the multi-ethnic people. In her remarks at the grand gathering were attended by Party Secretary General and President Bunyang Warachit, Plural Bureau member, also Prime Minister Tong Lun Si Sulit, government senior leaders, retired officials, and invited guests. <laughs> Madame Pani Yatoktu, Plural Bureau member and President of the National Assembly, highlighted history of the National Assembly, said saying, the Lao People's Revolutionary Party achieved the complete liberation of the country on December 2, 1975, with the foundation of the Lao People's Democratic Republic and the establishment of the Supreme People's Assembly by a nationwide People's Representatives Congress. The Supreme People's Assembly First Legislature had 45 members, of whom four were women. To honor the successes of the National Assembly in each period of time, the party and government has awarded the National Assembly one National Gold Order and one Class One Isla Order to Madame Pani Yatotu for her contribution as President of the National Assembly, which is the representative of the rights, powers, and interests of the multi-ethnic people. It is recorded that the National Assembly has rights and duties to consider and adopt government reports on the implementation of the socio-economic development and the state budget. To consider and approve the proposed appointment or a removal of the Prime Minister based on the recommendation of the President of the state. To oversee the observance and implementation of the Constitution and laws. Resolutions of the Session of the National Assembly. Resolutions of the National Assembly Standing Committee the socio-economic development plan and the state budget and projects that have national importance. To make decisions regarding liaison and cooperation with the parliament and international organizations at the regional and international levels and to exercise such other rights and perform such other duties as provided by the laws to name a few of rights and duties of the National Assembly. Though out 45 years, the National Assembly is the representative of the rights, powers, and interests of the multi-ethnic people. The past achievements and activities are valuable lessons for the new legislature of the National Assembly as well for future legislatures. Every legislature of the National Assembly has adopted laws and regulations adapted to the pace of development of the People's Democratic Government, thereby building the confidence of state officials and the Lao people from all social groups. This has brought the Lao people happiness and strengthened their respect for the party and the state, which have introduced a system where laws guarantee people's rights and obligations in society.